Hello and welcome to the PTZ Optics Computer Programming for Robotic Cameras course. I'm so excited for you to learn a little bit about this course where you can take computer programming to control robotic cameras. It's gonna be a lot of fun. So let me tell you a little bit about this course. So I will be your instructor. My name is Paul Richards and I am the Chief Streaming Officer here at PTZ Optics. I have a little bit of coding knowledge. I've coded for quite a long time, but this is actually some of the first advanced robotic coding that I've done in my career. So I'm really excited about this. Now this course is ideal for students that are in computer programming or robotics. If that makes you excited, this is going to be a course that is going to be a lot of fun. We're gonna learn a lot of great computer programming and get the chance to control a robotic device that's not only robotic, but it's also a live streaming camera. Now, the course benefits, of course, are the ability to take real computer programming languages like HTML, JavaScript, Node.js, Python, C, C++, some of the great programming languages, and learn how to use them in a real world application where we're actually controlling robotics. So not only are you gonna get great code examples, but real world opportunity to control a robotic device over an IP network. IP connectivity is really the key here because that's really the future of technology. So really excited about all of that. And the course components are gonna take you through the various computer programming languages, we're going to review sample code, which is available right now, open source on GitHub, which you're also going to learn how to use that. There's going to be a camera coding challenge, and there's going to be a geek out podcast session. So let me take you to my whiteboard. I want to kind of break this down for you, what you can expect in this great online course. And the first computer programming language is actually HTML. Okay. Everyone's used it before. It is a hyper um, hyper focused kind of web programming language and we're going to look at that programming language and learn how to use it in a very basic way so we're going to learn html we're going to learn a little bit of css we're really just dipping our toes in here but really uh with a focus of using the open source control codes that are available on github we're going to look at javascript and Node.js, which is a really great server-side version of JavaScript. So we're going to learn that. We're then going to take a quick look at GitHub, okay? Because I really think that you guys should be looking at GitHub, how to use the world's largest depository of source code in the world. We're going to learn how to use that. Then we're going to get into Python, which is a really great programming language for beginners, but it's also incredibly powerful. And for all of these, this is what we're going to start with. In the future, we're hoping to release C and C++. Now we do have open source code on this, but in the future, we're going to be looking at those, including Visual Basic. That's planned. But for this course currently today, as of now, each one of these are going to include the review video, the code review, the sample review, the coding challenge, and then the podcast, which is going to be a lot of fun. We're going to bring in the PTZ Optics lead engineer, our lead programmer, and myself. We're going to sit down and have a conversation about these different programming languages, how they're being used, and what you can do with them in the future. It's going to be a fun course, guys. I'm really excited about it. Not only all of that, but we have great documentation you can print out, which is included with the course, and all of the code available on GitHub has extensively been reviewed and documented with readme files and great documentation directly in the code. So this is for you guys out there in those computer programming courses. Now, the prerequisites, you will need a PTZ Optics camera. You will need a computer with a text editor to do computer programming, a GitHub account to access all of the code and a local area network to connect the ethernet from the computer to the camera using a network. If you don't know much about networking, don't worry, we're going to tell you about it. And you gotta get on GitHub to download those project files and use social coding. It's really uh, an amazing thing that you can use to do lots of great online collaboration with other robotics clubs, other people using open source code in the PTZ Optics community. That's it, folks. We're really excited to have you. I hope that you look below in the course description and hit that enroll button because we really want to have you as part of our community and everyone out there that's learning and coding together. It's going to be a great collaborative process. So enroll in the course. 
get the documentation, download the open source code, and let's see what your team can do with PTZ Optics IP-connected robotic cameras. See you soon.